one of the goals of the Myrtle Project is to manifest a student's state of attention on his or her avatar. Technically, that falls into two parts. First, sensing the attentive state of the student, and second, changing the appearance of the student's avatar accordingly. At the moment, we're waiting for the 0.5 release of Wonderland to provide us with a sophisticated avatar mechanism. In the meantime, we can use the existing crude avatar behaviour such as head shaking and head nodding to indicate reduced or increased attentiveness. To sense a student's attentive state, there are several existing commercial off the self sensors we could use. For example, the readings from a galvanic skin response sensor, a temperature sensor and a pulse sensor can be combined to give us a rough idea of the state of a student's secondary nervous system. However, more primitively, we could just ask the skewed student to actively indicate his or her attentive state by pressing a switch on a device. So, as a very primitive proof of concept, we've hooked up a, a sunspot to Wonderland to show how this can be achieved. The Wonderland Incubator project contains source code that enables users to control their Wonderland avatar using the accelerometer in the sunspot. We've modified that source so the switches can be used to indicate a student's state of attentiveness, which in turn causes his or her avatar to shake or nod its head accordingly. Let's see that in action. The sunspot only transmits data to the Wonderland client when the user's hand covers its light sensor. This is indicated to the user by the LEDs turning green. I can control the position of my avatar by tilting and rotating the sunspot. Alternatively, I can use the two switches to indicate my state of attentiveness. The left hand switch indicates that my attentiveness is reduced, and the right hand switch indicates that my attentiveness has increased. You can see that that is manifested on the user's avatar by head shaking and head nodding. Let's just do that again. As mentioned earlier, the Wonderland Incubator project contains all the source code. It also contains instructions and installation details about how to use your Sunspot to control your Wonderland client. Take a look at the following URL for more information.